welcome in this video i will explain how to convert a decimal number to octa number so i request the viewers regarding three issues the first one is most of the students registered on student candidate code attend but they are unable to write the examination due to not watched mock test video completely in the second point is some of them are wrote the examination but they are not answered all the questions and not spend complete time and my request is to spend 20 90 minutes of time to answer all the questions to know where you are similarly most of the questions means 65 to 80 percent of the model the questions are come in the examination so after completing your examination click on view key obviously you know the question and what is the answer you checked you checked and what is the right answer and what is the solution also we provided in the panel in the our software so utilize properly and the third important point is on 3rd jan 2019 at 7 pm i am conducting a live stream to give the tips for writing tcs smart hiring for bsc and bca and i will also clarify your doubts on live so decimal to octa conversation so here we divided with 8 so we will get some remainder that remainder is stored in this and b is equal to b into 10 so these are the lines of code n is equal to n by 10 n by 8 is the last code remainder is equal to n mod 8 that is the first line second line oct plus is equal to remainder into b and b is equal to b by 10 so first we take 63 63 mod 8 is equal to 7 and octa initially assigned to 0 0 plus remainder we get 7 into b is equal to 1 initially b is assigned to 1 so that 7 will come now b is equal to b into 10 means 1 into 10 is equal to 10 after that 63 by 8 is equal to 7 7 mod 8 is equal to 7 here how we will get 7 7 mod 8 is equal to 7 the remainder is in between 0 to 7 so that if when compared to divisor the dividend is less number obviously that is the remainder so that 7 mod 8 is equal to 7 next is octa is 7 plus 7 into 10 that is equal to 77 b is equal to 10 into 10 that is equal to 100 But seven by eight is equal to zero, so obviously the process will be closed. Look at the program. Here also I am using command and arguments. So arg one of arg v of one is is a string type, and this is converted to integer by using a to i function. So when c greater than zero, r is equal to c mod eight. S is equal to s plus r into b. C is equal to c by eight, and b is equal to b into ten. this is the process and similar to previous program but it here we divided with 8 and that process we are dividing with 10 that is only difference remaining thing is almost all same thank you